hello everyone in this video i will show you how to execute NatogX program on ubuntu so first of all we need to install NatogX and matplotlib library in order to execute NatogX program so in order to install uh, we need to use a apt package manager and in case uh, if uh, your network is having proxy servers so in that case you need to set proxy settings so how to do that just go to here and type network and open network so here uh, you will find the option network proxy and in your case if this method is automatic just select it manual and specify your proxy server IP and port number and then click on apply system wide it will ask you your password so just supply your password and you are done now next thing is that uh, when you uh, set your proxy server and port number so in that case we are not specifying user id and password we are not providing any authentication details so in order to do that what we need to do just open your terminal so in case if you don't have terminal here just go here and write terminal so in this terminal just execute this command sudo g edit etc apt apt.conf so in this file you will see some entry like acquire http proxy so here what you need to do you need to add here your user id and password and then at the rate so you have to do this one for same so here at the place of user you need to provide your user id and at the place of pwd you have to provide your password so once you are done click on save button so here i'm going to write my user id and password okay so when you are done just close this file what you have to do just execute this command sudo apt get update so this command will update your repository for packages so let this process complete make sure you have a internet connection and your connection is a working state So um, let's wait. Okay, so it's done. So next thing what we are going to do, we are going to install network x. So how to install network x? Just write this command sudo apt get install python network x. So in my case I have already installed it. So that's why it's uh, saying uh, I think python network x is already the newest version. But in your case it will ask you whether you want to install it or not so you need to press y and then it will start the installation process once it's done you need to install matplotlib library so how to do that install python matplotlib so in that case also uh, your installation process will ask you you want to install or not you have to press y so in my case i have installed both of them so once it's done now we are going to write our first network x program so i'm already having a uh, network x script so this is the script which i am having here uh, so this is the my script 
so in this script what we are doing we are first of all importing network x package and then we are importing matplotlib package for plotting the graph and here i have created a empty graph in that graph i have added one node node number three node number four and then i have connected node number three and four so if you are connecting some age and those nodes are not available in the graph in that case those nodes are also added in the graph so here what we are trying to do we are trying to create a edge between node 4 and node 5 and here if you can see we have not added any node with number 5 so in that case first of all this node will be inserted automatically and then one edge will be created and similarly for this one and here this line print annex.info.g it will print uh, the number of nodes number of edges of your graph so brief details of your graph and this line we are plotting our graph and uh, this line will show that plotted graph so let's execute this program so I'm saving this program on desktop okay now I need to go to terminal I need to change the directory and now I will run this program by writing python basic.py so if you can see uh, it has plotted the graph and it has also shown the details of the graph thank you very much for watching